YouTube, so slightly different video today. It's two o'clock in the morning. I've just got back from the Everton versus Arsenal game. What I've done is I've uploaded loads of little clips from before the game, during the game, and after the game, just so you can get an idea of what it's like to be at an away game with other Arsenal fans. Because I think that's kind of what I want to be doing rather than just spouting rubbish about the game. In terms of the game, though, I don't understand some of the things that are going on at the club, and they're basic things which make me just wonder who's in charge and why are they not making the right decisions. Why was Walcott taking corners again? He can't take them. Why did we have Giroud flicking the ball on when there are no players running beyond him? Why do we have Ramsey on the wing who can't run past people, can't take it round people, and offers no sort of pace or cohesion to the team? Why do we bring on Coquelin, a defensive midfielder for an attacking midfielder, when it's one all with three minutes of added time left? Why do we leave a substitution till that late? Wenger goes on and on and on about how the team's exhausted after away games and Champions League games all coming three, four days after each other. Well, how about we use substitutions which aren't in the last minute of the game, Arsene? How, that doesn't add up. You can't say one and then not make substitutions. And why not bring on the Ox to try and win the game? Just like against Villa, it screamed of us wanting to just set up shop and aim for fourth. I, I don't want to aim for fourth. I don't pay my money to, for such an expensive season ticket for fourth. If at the start of the season, everyone at the club says, oh, fourth place is what we're going for, fair enough, we can lower prices, we can all settle our expectations and go from there. But at the start of the season, all we're being told is, no, we're aiming for top, we're aiming for top. When, inevitably, like all the other seasons, we're clearly not anywhere near the top and we're struggling for the fourth spot, there's no accountability. No one cares. There's no, there's no problem in Arsene's eyes. When he comes out, there's no issue. He's doing everything he can. Well, why did we set the goal of being top? at the start of the season with the best squad technically he's ever had and yet when we're fourth or well not even fourth when we're clearly aiming for fourth and are struggling to get it there's no questions asked too many things are wrong little niggly things which don't make sense because there just seems like a lack of accountability now i'm going to be at the swansea game with a few other youtubers i'm going to try and record that so make sure you subscribe up there for other videos coming up and thank you very much for watching and speak to you soon paul Alright YouTube, so I've just come straight from our live hangout with the 12th men. We had Ollie from Mr. Nobots, we had Curtis Morton from The Gamer Can, we had Joel and Jules from Messy Minutes and Rich from The Armory Vlog, as well as me, PL Takeover. We had great chat in the comments, we had a great half-time game, 